The legendary ride, the Pirates of the Caribbean at Disneyland, allegedly had real bones when it originally opened in 1967. Now, I say allegedly because I don't want Disney to sue me, but allegedly it had real bones inside the ride when it first opened. Now, there have been rumors that throughout the years, throughout renovations, they have slowly taken out the bones, but a cast member allegedly in 2014, the cast member had confirmed that one of the skulls was still original. Disney apparently didn't like the look of the fake imagineered bones. They asked the college, UCLA, if they could provide real bones from the medical department, and they said, sure, why not? The scene with the real bones was the cave scene when you see all the skeletons inside the cave at the beginning of the Pirates of the Caribbean ride. Now, what do you guys think? Is this true? Is this a rumor? Leave a comment. Let me know.